keeping you ahead of the curve and informed about the ever-changing real estate market and in the know. This is The Cindy and Michael Show. Welcome to The Cindy and Michael Show. It's episode seven. Today, Cindy and I are going over the questions somebody should ask before they hire an agent. First of all, let's just remember that there's going to be a different set of questions that you're going to ask somebody if you're, they're going to represent you as a buyer or if they're going to represent you as a seller. Cindy, why don't we start by going over questions a prospective buyer should ask an agent if they're going to represent them as a buyer. Okay. Well, the first question that you want to ask an agent is, what is their negotiating style? And Michael and I went over that in episode four. So if you'd like to go back and look at episode four to understand the different negotiating styles, that would be great. And then secondly, you want to know, do they have access to off-market properties? So if the agent has access to off-market properties, that's going to give you additional buying opportunities. And then the next thing you want to ask them is how much experience they have. We know, Michael, the more experience an agent has, the more likely they are to get you into a home and have a successful close on your transaction. And then lastly, you want to ask them how do they represent buyers? So is the agent taking you in for a formal buyer consultation? And during that consultation, are they making sure that they understand what your specific needs are? And are they going over the entire buying process with you so you have a clear understanding of what's entailed during that process? Such an important step. Yeah. So now we're gonna go over what questions you should be asking your agent if you're gonna be selling a home. There's obviously a different set of questions that you're gonna wanna ask. And the five questions we most get asked all the time is you know number one how much is my home going to sell for right that's an important question how long is it going to take to sell how are you going to market and advertise my home right how are you how are you different than any of your competition Mm -hmm. and then how much do you charge and then one question we honestly rarely ever get asked is how are you going to support me as a seller how are you going to protect me and and keep me out of out of trouble because as you know in california it's such a litigious state that it's important for an agent to keep you well insulated during the entire transaction to make sure you get to a successful close and then make sure you're not liable for anything after after you close the transaction as well. Absolutely, so that is an important question that a lot of sellers leave out. It's, you know, how well does the agent understand contracts and how are they going to keep you protected contractually, make sure that you're, disclosing everything there, there's quite a bit that goes into an actual transaction you want to make sure your agent understands and knows contracts and is going to keep you very well protected we, we see contracts written up incorrectly all the time and it's it's up to oh, your yeah. agent to clean up what another agent potentially has done mm-hmm. to keep your to keep your their client out of out of harm's way absolutely thank you so much for watching episode seven of the cindy and michael show we'll see you guys next week Bye-bye.